that there's usually a huge gap between the law and the books and what happens in the polling place. And that's because we have an incredibly decentralized system of election administration in this country, more than any other country in the world. And you'll often, and this was what happened in the Pennsylvania a voter ID case, where the Philadelphia, you know, election supervisor said, yeah, you can have a voter ID, though, we're just not going to enforce it, right? And then it's also the case that in the polling place, it's not like the average poll worker who has maybe six hours of training, if you're lucky, knows the ins and outs of a voter ID law, right? We even find in states that don't have voter ID that something like 40% of people think that a voter ID is required in order to vote. So you have this, this huge uh, gap between the law and books and the perceptions as to what uh, is actually required.